What is going everybody? Welcome back to another video. And in this video, you probably saw it on the thumbnail and the title of the video. But we are going to be showing you guys all of our hockey jerseys. It's not just Devils jerseys. It's all our NHL jerseys. Um, well, it's more all NHL for me. Yeah, more all... Jake has like a wide variety of them. I have... I think I all of them are Devils except one. Mm. <clears throat> so... We're gonna be going from newest to oldest, so um, let's. We're gonna start off with mine. So the latest jersey I got was um, Jack Hughes, a Jack Hughes jersey. It's signed, and I actually got this from. Um, if you've ever been to a Devils game, you would right, know. I'm sure that, they have the other teams too. Yeah, they. So the Devils do. Uh, um, investors Bank coin shuffle. Investors Bank is just the sponsor for it, but they do a coin shuffle. And the winner gets to do gets um uh gets um uh signed, signed jersey. jersey. It just happened that Jack Hughes was signed jersey the time that I did it. And actually, before that game, on the same exact day, it was the New Year. I, th I think it was the New Year's Eve game. The New Year's Eve game, right, Jacob? Yeah. For the New Year's Eve game before the game, I got this Nikita Gusev jersey. It's signed, but I didn't get it signed. I got regular. I then got it signed after. But it was the same exact day, but I got before the game, the Jack Hughes I got in the middle Dang. period. Or, like, early third period, I think. But, so, those two I got on the same day. They were, they're extremely close, and but I got that on the same day. <clears throat> okay, so the next jersey I have was a Blake Coleman jersey. Um... And, um, I really love Blake Coleman. I was so sad to see him go. Um, even, like, and I got this jersey signed, like, like, right before he got traded, I think. It was, like, very close to when, like, a around. Month before. Yeah, about a month before he got traded. And I love Blake Coleman. A lot of people did. I mean, he brought something to the Devils that we haven't had in a while. He's, like, he's so aggressive. I feel like he's just so aggressive on the yeah, ice. He, like he 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 brought something to our penalty kill that was so so good. Like that, no, like the Devils hadn't seen since John Madden. Yeah, we haven't we hadn't seen someone on that uh, so aggressive on the penalty kill like John Madden and Blake Coleman scored so many shorthanded goals. He scored nine shorthanded goals in three full seasons. Yeah, I know. Like he scored so much shorthanded goals, and that's why I really loved him. And I was so sad to see him go, and that's why I got a jersey of him. Well, I mean, you didn't get it because you were so sad to see him go. Yeah, I got it because I really loved him. Right. Next jersey I have, Kyle Paul Mary. Um, I think I got this jersey. I got this jersey for Hanukkah. Yeah, uh, in 2017. Yeah, and I got this because I think I, I was thinking of a jersey to get for Hanukkah because I needed a new jersey because, as you'll see from the... New, new jersey. Before. Yeah, uh, new jersey. Uh, 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 so I needed a new jersey and you'll see, um, you'll see why because of the one before. And, um, and, uh, so the, the I... The two before, the two after this. Yes, yeah. yeah. Yeah, and so I decided to go with Kyle Palmieri. Palmieri was a really good player on the Devils, um, and um, he was he like I, he was maybe probably my favorite at the time. I really loved. Um, it, he had an amazing one timer. It still has. It yeah, does. so it does. But I really liked him. Uh, I still really like him. But uh, I don't think this jersey fits anymore. This is the first jersey that doesn't fit anymore. I think. Yeah. So uh, really moving on. Taylor Hall. Um, well, Hall, I couldn't wear. I need to get a new jersey. But Hall was too big. My my grandparents had a big oof on this one. Like, I was, like, very young at the time I got this. And they, I, I was like, probably around, like, a youth large for a jersey size at the time. Maybe. No. It's, um, it's a lot smaller than that. Maybe you, probably youth medium. Youth medium. Yeah, mm -hmm. and my grandparents said a big oof, Danny, an adult small Taylor Hall jersey. If, Eli, if you were in a youth, if you were a youth large, you probably could have worn it. But yeah, you were, you were either a youth small or a youth medium. But yeah, yeah, and then, but and so I had to wait a long time. I think I started wearing it at like the end of last season. Yeah, or no, the or like the middle. And I got season. it a couple years before that. The only and, the only person I ever wore it, worn it before that is Jacob wore it. For a couple games when he didn't have a jersey to wear, um, and that was the only one but, that was close to fitting him. But not actually, no, not this. Just go do this one. But then 
the one after this is the reason why Eli had to get the Kyle Palmieri jersey. It's a jersey with my name on it. Gordon. Gordon 7. Oh, 07. I don't know why it's, um, they had to put a zero on it. I think that's just how it works. But I really wanted one with my name on it, so I got it. And then this is the reason why. Probably maybe one of my favorite devil probably maybe one of my favorite this is probably one of my favorite devils players of all the time that I was alive for. Adam Henrique. I love this guy. I I even met him in person one on one for like ten minutes. It was amazing. I this guy Adam Henrique was just like I really liked him. He was a very a very good player. He's really talented. Um I <laughs> and like I just really liked him. And so I had to get a jersey of him. It's signed by Adam Henrique. And on this side, signed by um, one of these, I think it's this one, is Bruce Driver. And the other one is Chico Resch. That's three jerseys. So three signatures on one jersey. I think that's re that's the record for me. And I actually tried to beat that with my Palmieri. I got signed by Palmieri and Ken Danico, Ken Danico but never got signed by anyone else. Um, so after he got traded... I I think I wore the um, Goran jersey for one game, and then I got the new jersey. Uh, this is the one from the from another team, Alex Ovechkin. Um, I think I got this because I really I, I we we're gonna go to we usually go to Maryland for Thanksgiving, and that specific Maryland uh, Maryland Thanksgiving, uh, I wanted to see a Washington Capitals game. So and I, I I for some I thought that you had to have a jersey to go to the game. So I got this my dad bought me this Alex Ovechkin jersey. And um yeah. I'm pretty sure the next time I went to a game a game for another team was St. Louis and I got creative wearing a Marlboro Jer Bro Door jersey who was their assistant at GM. Okay, we're at the you final mean, jersey. You mean Scout? What? You mean Scout? Bro Door was wasn't he the assistant GM? No. Well, eh. Okay, my first jersey I ever got, which I could find, and Patrick Eliash. Um, I really liked him. And he is another one of my favorite Dallas players of all time. And so I got a jersey of him, of him um, and um, I got signed. Uh, yeah, so pretty cool. Uh, but one more thing I have to mention. I did have a Yamir Yager jersey at one time. But I do not know where it is. So let's get on to my jerseys. Okay. Your jerseys. So uh, my segment's going to be a bit longer. As I Eli has Devils jerseys. And uh, he has a lot of Devils jerseys. But he doesn't have that many jerseys about I the teams. I think I wore Devils jerseys than you. Yeah, you do. Definitely. Yeah. I, I but I, I think I... Actually, if you do... Shoot, are we counting the ones... Like wearable ones? Or are we counting the ones that we had before? Ones that we had. So then, um, I have, yeah, I mean, you'll see how, which ones I have, but the last one Eli did was 26. Eliash, my first one, we're going, uh, most recent, at least recent, is it's another 26. Ow. Rosmus Dahlin. Uh, I got this one, uh, my birthday is this weekend, but I got it as an early birthday present. So everyone in the comments wish you up an uh, early birthday. Yeah, happy birthday. My birthday is, is May 17th. Uh... So yeah, here's a Rosmus, this Rosmus Dahlin jersey. I mean, not really much of a story behind this. I just uh, my goal is to get one jersey for every single team, and I wanted Dahlin for the Sabers. I thought it was a safe pick. So yeah. And just saying, we're pro if you got Jacob a jersey, and, and if you got Jacob a jersey, we're gonna be shouting you out. I think. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, well. This jersey I got as a Hanukkah present from my. Grandparents in Maryland, the one where we go down um, uh, Thanksgiving. Do they, do they watch it? I don't know. If they uh, watch it. But if you are watching, shout out to you guys. Um, so he has a Vladimir Tarasenko St. Louis Blues jersey, and this is one of my favorite jerseys in my collection. Um, just the coloring, the striping, everything is perfect on this jersey. Except the Saint, I, like, Saint logo on the back. Well, I mean, I, I don't really care about that, but, but I mean, if it, if the Blues made this their main jersey, I uh, I would be 
happy. Like, I, I would prefer, prefer that. I, that's one of your, my favorite jer of your jerseys. That's one of my favorite of your jerseys. Next one I got, uh, so basically the timeline is April 2020. Um, then the Blues one was December of 2019. This one's August 2019. Uh, Jack Hughes jersey. I got this on uh, Fanatics. Evi's one's Adidas. Um, I got this one, um, like, basically right after he was drafted. He was one of my favorite players on the Devils. Um, he's definitely going to ra ra rise up my ranks if he has a really much better uh, year next year, which I'm sure he will. And there we go, Jack Hughes jersey. Not much uh, story behind this. Actually, well, I mean, I, I, my parents bought it with my money, but I was at camp, and then I came home for a little bit during the middle of the summer, just for a small break, and then I was there. Go to a high, um, uh, high school yeah, orientation. orientation. Yeah. Uh, Alright, so this, sorry if it cut out there, I just had to tell me, uh, I just had to uh, fix something, but um, then this next jersey I got, so that last one was August 2019, this one was December 2018, it's a Jesper Bratt jersey, and, uh, it is signed by Jesper Bratt. Jesper Bratt is my favorite player on the Devils, probably my favorite player in the entire NHL. He is such a fun player to watch. His skating is insane. He's great on his edges, great playmaking ability, great, uh, you know, he's just insane. Uh, Braden Holpe, this one, uh, we're gonna go... Back to uh, June 2018. Uh, it's, you know, an Adi my only Adidas jersey. Uh, Stanley Cup Champion Edition. Bring Hopi. Uh, so, my next one is signed. This is a, I got this, I believe, June 2018 or 2018 yeah, as well. Yeah, it was a bar mitzvah present. It was a present from the Xander. So, yeah. if you're watching this video, shout out, shout out to you guys. Uh, assistant Captain Joe Thornton, signed jersey. Not sure if we're going to see the signature, but it is signed by Joe, Jumbo Joe. Um, next one I got, these next three I got at the same time. All right, so... Um, these next few I got all at the same exact time, but I'm just putting it in a random order. Uh, I got this vintage Vancouver Canucks, no name on the back. This is one of my favorite jerseys. Um, vintage Chicago Blackhawks. Uh, yeah, not much really to talk about here. <laughs> vintage San Jose Sharks. Which, I mean, I, I was trying to figure out the difference for this jersey. For a very long time, I finally realized in the New Jersey, it's uh, like... I'm sorry about that, it just cut out again. I, actually, I just got a call from my friend, who I will mention in actually just a minute, but uh, another one I got in the bunch I just showed you is a Bruins Cam Neely jersey. He is... I hate almost every Bruin ever, but him and Ray Borf, I I really like. They're two of my favorite... My two favorite Bruins I actually like. So yeah, uh, next one, Eli actually got me as a bar mitzvah present, Jonathan Taves. Worked hard to raise the money. Uh, if you're noticing, there are a lot of, yeah, shout out Eli, who had like a lemonade stand and a bake sale to raise the money to get me this Jonathan Taves jersey. Um, I was broke at the time, I think. I, I can't remember. Uh, now this jersey, the friend who just called me, Ryan, shout out Ryan, I know he watches our, I know for... A fact, he watches our video, so shout out Ryan for getting me this Riley Smith jersey. It is my only Vegas Gold Knights jersey. Vegas is actually my third favorite team behind only the Washington Capitals and the New Jersey Devils. And um, it's one of my favorite jerseys. I wear it a lot. And thank you, Ryan, for getting me this back. Uh, this was, I, by the way, these are all May now. Uh, the bunch I got you, I saw, showed you before, the vintage ones. I got this for my grandparents for as a birthday present. Um, that would well, be May 17th. Uh, then Jonathan Tay's one, I got May 17th. This one I got just a few days before that. Probably like May 15th or something like that. This one I got, uh, like a few weeks before that. Vintage Larry Robinson. I think like your dad's work friend got it. Yeah, I got it as a bar mitzvah present from my dad's work friend. He definitely doesn't watch. I don't think he watches. Yeah, no. So, yeah. Uh, but I guess shout out my dad's work friend. <laughs> we don't even know his name. Uh, 
This next one I got with my own money, and it's a Nick Backstrom jersey, and uh, I, I, it's not gonna lie, I think it's probably fake, but um, still, it you, is a... You wear a lot. I used to, not as much anymore, but Nick Backstrom jersey, and I, so yeah, okay, sorry, just cut it out again, I, Eli told me something, um, but um, this jersey, uh, another jersey I got from my grandparents, a signed Travis Zajac jersey, he was another one of my favorite devils, um, I love his defensive game, I really look up to, look up to him, if I can compare my style of play to any one current devil, it would definitely be Travis Ajak. And yeah, signed. So, um, this next one, we're getting to, basically that one was, oh yeah, uh, the Bastion jersey was probably March or February of 2018. That one was December 2017. Now we're going to jump all the way back to um, uh Probably April or May of 2014. I don't think you've ever worn that jersey. I don't think I've ever worn this jersey. I, I think Sam but Shane I, Brown I, wore it. I inherited it. I think Sam for, Shane Brown wore it one time to the was game. It was someone's, and I just got it. They gave it to me. So, yeah. I think, no, I think, no, Sam Shane Brown Sam wore Sam Shane Brown wore this jersey. So, I think if you're watching it, he might watch it. I'm Maybe. Sure. But I think his brother does. Uh, and then these, we get two left. <laughs> um... This is Zach Parise jersey. Um, if that 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 this is a very funny story. So I got this jersey for a birthday present, May twenty twelve. Because Parise is <laughs> when I was younger was my favorite player, and um, so I got this for a birthday for my and, seventh birthday and in my, May two thousand twelve. And our grandpa worked so hard to get the jersey and, 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 and to get and, and signed. To, to, and he worked really hard to get the jersey signed <laughs> for me and to, for him and to say happy birthday. Um, uh, and then two months later, he signed with the Wild and Free Agency. But I'm over it now, and I actually really like Zach Parise. Um, and I'm actually, before I show this last jersey, jersey but not colors-wise, it's probably my favorite jersey in my collection. Sadly, I can't wear it anymore. But uh, three, I'm getting three jerseys in the mail. Uh, one, two of them I, are fake, uh, most likely, and I... Bought them with my own money. One of them is a birthday present. One of them is actually Zach Parise Wild jer Minnesota Wild jersey. Fanatics. Um, and That's going to be our only duplicate jersey. Well, not kinda. Duplicate. No. Kinda. Really. I mean, it's a, it's a only it's going to be our first two jerseys that the, that's the same player. Maybe. Yeah. You, oh, yeah. Well, yeah. will be. Well, we have a lot of Brewer jerseys. But oh, yeah. 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 Um, and then... Um, I have a Tyler Sagan and Connor McDavid jersey, uh, jerseys in the mail. And this last one, <laughs> Ilya Kovalchuk black ice jersey. This is absolutely sick. And they have to bring these back. They have yeah, to. They, they don't sell they, them. They, they have to bring these back and make them the Devils alternate jerseys forever. Uh, but they yeah. don't sell them anymore, but please put them back on that, the market. That's it. Uh, that's all of me and Eli's jerseys, our entire collections combined. And do the outro. Uh, yeah, but before we do the outro, um, we'd like to give one big, big, humongous Major shout out. Major shout out. To our grandma and grandpa. You got us most of these jerseys. J both me and Jacob's piles would be much smaller if it weren't for you guys. So thank you yeah, so much. Sure. So, yeah, thank you so much. I know you, I know you guys watch our videos. Yeah. So thank you, thank you, thank you so much. And, uh, now... That's, we're going to wrap up the video. That's going to be it. Remember to subscribe, like, uh, com maybe le leave a comment what jerseys you have in your collection. And um, cool. and see if you have more than us combined. But oh, and one more thing. Um, next week, we're going to do kind of like a little teaser, kind of. But next week, we're going to start a new series called... Um, it's where we talk about alternate reality. We'll start with next week where we're going to be discussing what if Mario Lemieux went to the Devils, which he almost did. And you'll see why next week. So anyway, that's going to be it for this video, and we'll see you next time.